This is an absolute game changer. I've just been on the train for three hours and I could not take it off. It is incredible. So this is it, the Microsoft HoloLens. I've attached it to my laptop and I'm gonna move the camera behind me so you can see everything that I'm seeing when I try this on. Um, it's got an adjustable strap at the back. I don't need the lead to run this, but this is purely so I can project the images onto my laptop so I can demonstrate to you how this works. Okay, let's get ready. So the first thing I wanna show you is how I interact with the HoloLens from a business perspective. So here I'm gonna open Excel, um, and this is directly connected to Office 365. It's a bit difficult to talk and do this at the same time. Um, so here I can access all of my work documents, and I can make this pretty much any size I want to. And I can push it farther away, or keep it nice and close, And I can then view all of my documents, files, photos, and access the web. So here you've got Microsoft Edge, um, and this is my blog. So I've got the scroll tools where I can scroll down um, and read anything that I want through, on a web browser. And then you've got these really cool aspects like holograms, which are just so clear and so surreal. Here I've got a Word document. Again, this is using the very clever HoloLens technology where it maps every object in your room. So you can pinpoint and, and place holograms anywhere. Here you'll see a really cool satellite. And there's a man doing weights here. The drone is real, by the way. The man doing weights is not real. Um, if I forget where things are, I've got this cool um, labeling system where I can label pretty much anything. So there I've got cam. Here I've got a YouTube video open on a mu multiple Microsoft Edge browser. Um, and if I click play, you should see my uh, holiday snaps. Or holiday video. Now, to put it into perspective, I've got a 60 inch TV in this room, and this is probably about 100 inches. So you can see that you would have thought that at one point we won't need TVs or monitors anymore um, because I can have as many monitors, as many TVs as I want, not taking up any space or electricity. Um, what I want to try and get across here is the, how clear this is. It's it's so weird that it's right in front of me. It's almost hard to explain that it feels real. It feels like I'm actually looking at a monitor. Now, this next app is so amazing. Um, kind of hard to put into words again. If I look at something and then click, it will actually map the room. So hopefully you can see this is using all these different colours and shapes to match every item in the room and lay over it. I mean, it's just awesome. So I can click and get different shapes. I can click anywhere in the room and you can see. Now I'm actually looking at the video of how this looks on the screen and it doesn't do it justice because through the hollow lens, you don't get the black edges that you're seeing. It's perfectly, perfectly accurate over all of the different parts of, of uh, this lounge. It's just unbelievable. It's so trippy to look at. What an experience. Now this one just blows my mind. You can zoom into a number of galaxies in our universe and obviously I've gone into our solar system. Now, again, when I click to look at more detail at our sun, it's probably the best visual I've ever seen of our sun, including the TV. Um, and I'm hoping that this video will do it justice and you can see the solar flares erupting or shooting out of the sides. Now, my favourite planet, uh, like most people's, is Saturn. And I had this on yesterday on the train. And it's just so surreal having this 3D planet standing right in front of me. And again, the quality is just amazing. Now check out this 3D shark hologram. I'm going to try to keep it in my field of view. But look at that. How amazing. So now I've made the shark larger, actually quite scary to have in my front room. So I'm gonna try and keep this in my field of view and also try and keep relatively still. 
But here's to give you an idea of the quality Wow, incredible, huh? The possibilities for AR are endless. So I've decided to write a blog about them, which you can click on here. I touch on all the areas where AR can help now and in the future. I discuss, I discuss topics such as volumetrically captured video conferencing, um, AR street dating, AR personal shopping. Imagine for one second Donatella Versace in your house as your personal shopping assistant. Unbelievable. And also I touch on some privacy areas, such as what if we use AR to recognize emotions of friends? The technology exists now. We'll be able to tell if friends are lying or if they're unhappy or sad. So I touch on a bit more, I go into a bit more detail than I did in the video in the blog. So please take your time to read it. Please also subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna put more interesting stuff out like this, which I hope you'll find uh, very interesting. And the final thing I wanna say about AR, it, and then the reason why I love AR, is that it keeps us in the real world. There's so many other technologies at the moment that take us out of the real world. AR keeps us in the real world, but it enhances it at the same time. Thanks for listening.